masama bang lumaban para sa kalayaan? Masama bang ipagtangkol ang bayan laban sa pangaabuso at pangaapi? Masama bang magsalita para sa mga takot mga tuwiran? Kasalanan bang ilantad ang mga katiwalayang nangyari sa ating bansa? Krimen bang maituturing ang pagpapakabayani sa sariling bansa? Ito ang kwento ng buhay at kabayanihan ni Dr. Jose Rizal. Jose Rizal was born June 19, 1861 in Calamba, Laguna to Teodora Alonzo and Francisco Mercado. The childhood of Jose Rizal can be characterized by his desire to learn. Jose Rizal was not physically blessed or strong he was close to her sister Concepcion. They always spent time playing together. However, he had a strong will guided and taught by his mother, his first teacher. At the age of five, the young Pepe learned to read the Spanish family Bible, which he would refer to later in his writings. He learned almost without the use of books. His mother was the one who laid the foundation of his great knowledge achieved in such a short time. His brilliance was also the character of the young Jose Rizal. Doña Teodora Alonso was a very religious woman, a prayerful woman, during night time, she spent her time teaching the Angelus prayer to the children. And tell them stories. Concepcion got sick. And later died in 1865. Jose mournfully wept at losing her. He is a man of many things, a patriot, physician, writer, an inspiration, and a Philippine hero. At the age of 16, he entered Ateneo Municipal de Manila, taking the Bachelor of Arts degree in 1877. He was a member of the Academy of Spanish Literature and the Academy of Natural Sciences. He also studied in the University of Santo Tomas and later on studied abroad. He really loves books and spend time reading while learning.
Sabi ko na nga sa'yo, tigilan mo na yung pagkatrabaho mo. Okay na ako, okay na. Ha? So... Inay! Mahal! Itay! Mahal! Itay! Ito nga sa'yo! Itay, magtawag ka na Tinipon ko kayo ngayon upang ating pagplanuhan ang pag-aklas laban sa mga Espanyol. Tama! Sumusobre na sila! Hindi na makatarungan ang ginagawa nila sa ating mga Pilipino. Sana merong taong may lakas na ito Tama! Si Dr. Rosarizal, siya lang ang may kapangalang tumuloy sa atin. Mabuhay, Susi Rizal! Mabuhay! Mabuhay ang Pilipinas! Mabuhay! Ang papel na ito ay simbolo ng pagsakop ng Espanya sa ating bansa. Punitin ninyo ang inyong mga sinula at magkaisa tayo sa imagsikal. Punitin! Por favor, dihide! Mga tamad talaga kayo mga indios! Mga labastangan! Good study, Senor. Nahuli na po namin si Dr. Rosorizal. Gracias. Papasokin. Magandang gabi, Gubernador. Ano po yung may paglilingkod ko sa inyo? Ano yung nababalitaan ko na ikaw yung nangungulo sa pag-aaklas? Totoo ba? Kasalanan bang maituring ang ipagtanggol ko yung aking kababayan? Kasalanan bang maisiwalag ang katotohanan? Malibang hangarin ang kalayaan sa aming bansa! Por favor, dehede! Isa kang traidor! Nasa kamay mo na ang pag-usga sapagkat ako'y lumalaban para sa aking bayan.
Here we go!